following reaction has been brought to you by Jason JV. Oh, if you thought I was going to miss this, well then you don't know me very well now, do ya? <laughs> I'm not. I'm not properly dressed for the occasion. I, you know, I, I. I need to remedy that situation. So, uh, oh yeah, baby. <laughs> now we is good to go. But first, intro. I, uh... Yo, what's good guys? It is your boy Jason JV saying welcome to another video. And yes, yes, y'all, we are about to get into the WWE 2K22 NWO Edition trailer. So yeah, now y'all know how, how we do with, with these trailers, you know what I'm saying? We're going to give them the little run through and then we're going to wind it back and we're going to break it down like D-Generation X, you know what I'm saying, bro? So without further ado, y'all, like the hey hey. Go. The following announcement has been paid for by the New World Order. Oh yeah. Alright y'all, let's go ahead and wind this back from the beginning because we need to break this down because I have noticed some things. I noticed some things. Let's go. The following announcement has been paid for by the New World Order. Okay, so as we can clearly see here, a little bit of a historical inaccuracy, you know, when uh, NWO first form and they would originally make their way out to the ring. They didn't really have the black and white uh, effect, video effect, you know what I'm saying, in WCW. They didn't have that until they made their way into WWE. But you know what? It is all good either way. I don't mind the uh, inaccuracy in this case. Um, it makes all the sense in the world, given with their style of promos. You know, those little vignettes that, that they would shoot when they would cut their promos in, in the black and white setting. So yeah, it makes all the sense in the world to have them have their entrance be in black and white as well. But anyway, I like that we got Hollywood Hogan here in the NWL sold out arena. We got the Harley Davidsons on on both sides of Hogan right here at the entrance way here. That's gonna be badass. Now I wonder since we got the Harley Davidsons here, I wonder if we can make when we do when we decide to go to create a arena in the creation suite. Can we implement the Harleys up on stage? Can we make our own, like, you know what I'm saying? Custom, like, motorcycle club style wrestling arena with the Harley Davidsons up on stage? That would be fire, man. I can't wait to explore that. Let's go. Also, oh, okay. So it says um, in the edition we are getting alternate attire, uh, attire, attires. So yeah, so we got Scott Hall rocking the the OG Outsiders T-shirt right here, bruh. Let's see if we can get a better sh shot. Yeah, there we go. Yo, that is fire. The Outsiders T-shirt. Hell yeah, that's fire, bruh. This, this is gonna be dope. And then here we got Eric Bischoff. Oh, look, man. We got four Harleys up on stage. And speaking of stage, another stage inaccuracy. They didn't have a ramp originally, but I mean, I get it, you know, being that, you know, it's a WWE game. You know what I mean? You're going to have a little inaccuracies here and there. Again, don't mind the inaccuracies, but it is something worth noting um, because originally the NWO sold out arena, um, it had stairs. You know what I mean? Um, the uh, wrestlers would have to walk down a set of stairs, a flight of stairs, if you will, to make their way down to the uh, aisle. So they could walk the aisle, as Nature Boy Ric Flair would say. And yeah, we got four Harleys up on stage. So again, I wonder if we decide to make a custom arena, can we you know, implement the Harley Davidsons up on the stage? Because I would like to do like a newer um, 
updated NWO style arena because I like to see if I can do a uh, a NWO revision storyline. You know what I'm saying? And maybe do like a have like a revised NWO faction go up against a revised D Generation X faction. You know what I'm saying? I think that'd be a dope story. Anyway. As you can see, we got my man Eric Bischoff here. We got old old Easy E himself, Eric Bischoff. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he's looking pretty good. Pretty good. You know what I mean? The old school Eric Bischoff. I wonder if that's the only version of Bischoff we're gonna get, or are, are we gonna get the later version of Bischoff? Um, you know, with the short gray hair and the you know the uh, goatee and everything. I guess we'll find out when we get the game. And then we got Kevin Nash. In what appears to be um, his all red um, outsiders attire, I'm assuming that's what this is right here. The all red attire um, that he debuted in with Scott Hall at Bash of the Beach 1996. Yeah, man, I can't wait! I can't wait! It's gonna be sweet. And then we got X Pac, or should I say six? Ah, he, he looking pretty dope. He, I wonder if this NWO shirt he's wearing, if, if it has this, the uh, the uh, six ball uh, on the on the back. And how funny, you know, the uh, six ball was the green ball, you know what I'm saying, on uh, X-Pac's uh, personal NWO shirts. Because, you know, when my man began fired from WCW, it makes his way back to the WWE. F, as they were known at the time, he would join a faction where, you know, one of their colors is green. So, hmm. Coincidence? Maybe. Anyway. Okay, so they're talking about the My Faction bonuses. Let's see. If, can we wind that back some? Bruh. There we go. So, the NWO for Life Edition WWE 2K22 includes My Faction bonuses. So I wonder if that means like uh, attire pieces, you know what I mean? Like maybe you get some NWO attire pieces for like if you want to, again, if you want to make a revised NWO, you know what I'm saying? Bruh, that would be fun. That, that would be fire. Let's go. So yeah, I was right. This is Kevin Nash in his all red attire. Okay. And then we got, we're seeing more shots of the NWO arena, you can see we got the NWO ring, NWO logo on the mat, you know what I'm saying, with the black mat, black ropes, and yo, there's a Hardy Davidson out in the crowd. There's a Hardy Davidson right there out in the crowd. That is dope. X-Pac doing the X-Factor. Oh, and there's Bischoff. So I guess his jacket he was wearing was his entrance attire. Here we got Bischoff standing here in a fighting stance. And he's and he's down to his t-shirt and jeans. Okay. Okay. Man, I got I gotta see Hogan. Hogan look Hogan not, not looking too shabby. He looking alright. Although I am noticing this weird thing his arm is doing, his left arm is doing right here between his bicep and his forearm. You know what I mean? Like his elbow, elbow, his uh, inner elbow joint. <clears throat> if I could properly get that out, you know what I mean? It's kind of doing this weird thing right here. You know what I mean? That that, that don't be looking right. I'm pretty sure muscles don't be don't don't be uh, shaped that way. So <clears throat> I'm gonna hope and pray. And this is probably pre-alpha build, you know what I'm saying? Hopefully that'll be fixed in the final product. Um, I did notice, um, if you guys watched my reaction video of the WWE 2K uh, gameplay video with the Rey Mysterio Damian Priest match, um, I forget I forget the woman's name, but she was saying something about them releasing patches and stuff, which had me concerned. So, hmm. I wonder if uh, they're gonna they're gonna patch this right here because this like I said this don't be looking right. This arm right here, this arm right here, the right arm looks fine. I mean that looks natural right there. This right here does not. So I don't know. I don't know. I'm still holding out hope. Okay, I want I want this game to be good. I want this game to be the absolute best ever, especially after 
you know what we had to deal with with uh, 2k20 so yeah guys that was the WWE 2k22 NWO edition trailer and yo get that a thumbs up because yes yes that was that was a nice little little teaser kind of giving us a little um a little, a little appetizer you know what i'm saying so what do we what to be expected uh, when we get the end of your edition oh yeah i'm pumped for this are you guys pumped for this let me know in the comment section down below you know what i'm saying i'm always up for a nice civil discussion about what we just saw here you know what i'm saying and uh, let me know if there's things that you guys noticed about this trailer that I may have missed. You know what I'm saying? Let's, ha let's have a nice little little combo in the comment section down below. I look forward to checking out y'all's feedback as I always do. And uh, guys, don't forget, if you uh, are digging this video, you're more than welcome to hit that thumbs up down below. You know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah. If you, wanna, if, if you haven't seen a trailer yet, you want to watch and listen to this one on your own free time, uninterrupted as you would like, hey. Link for the original video will be in the description down below. You're more than welcome to hit that up whenever you like, as many times as you like. You know what I'm saying? And um, guys, don't forget, in the description down below, I got the link for my main channel. Um, if you like, uh, if you like watching music reactions, you love music, uh, my main channel has now been updated. It is now my official artist page. I got music of my own that you guys are more than welcome to come check out. You know what I'm saying? I also got some reactions. On there as well I did re uh, react to the new uh, Ryan Upchurch uh, people's champ music video you know what I'm saying uh, named after his album people's champ and yes I didn't put a uh, a rock reference in the thumbnail so yeah y'all please y'all go peek that out man that would that would mean the world you know what I'm saying and if you're digging what I'm doing over there please subscribe to the main channel if you're digging what I'm doing over here please subscribe to the second channel as well that would be greatly appreciated and uh, yeah, don't forget to check out, of course, all the other links in the description down below. And uh, yeah, it's your boy Jason JV saying, until the next one, y'all have a blessed one. All right, peace. Too sweet me. The preceding reaction has been brought to you by Jason JV.